apparently in the early movies of Hulu, ladies and gentlemen. Yep, and the drugs don't breathe. Okay, only one question. Please, please be good. That's all I want to do. Well, and here we go. I think it was the awful, awful bit of the uncut-out horror. And, well, I just don't believe I don't mean a good movie, but I just don't know if this is going to work. We didn't burn so many times uh, since we got uh, the good alien movie. So, I'm not going to hold my breath after it and see if it's going to be good But I didn't burn before. We'll see. Ain't that wrong? Hey, guys, me on Touch Boy, and um, we got a new alien movie coming out at the end of year. Well, not this year. I think we're... Next year, one would say, Come on, Hulu! Yay! Has our new alien movie from the director of the Don't Breathe, which that could be really good or really bad. So, on the way I'm having a new alien movie, I know I know I don't trust Big Out to the studio, but it could ruin the alien friend. Then it probably turns into about not involved, but didn't involve, and that could be really good or really bad. But let's, let's be honest again. The trying to be alien movie have been, how can I say this? Oh, what? Bad! So, forgive me for a sec, I just don't know how I feel about this. I do want to have a good new movie, and I'm also worried because, let's be honest, if we're just involved, then we're fucked. So, yeah, this will be fun. Again, what I mean by that? Well, you'll find out, ain't them. So, you want to find any, any, any news? Oh, yeah, one more thing. What again, I'm waiting to, which, I'm not gonna talk about that, because honestly, look, I like I'm right there, I think the pretty good, my band is super annoying, by the way. But, I don't think we need a sequel to I Am Legend, because that story ended. There's nobody else to go with that movie. There's nobody else to go with your prequel. Flash in the cave. Go with the ball. Well, fuck, fuck. I think we're going to do that. I think we're going to fall apart. But, that's a different topic another day. So, it should be fun. Again, what do you mean by that? Well, you'll find out. Um, so, it's my part. And it's the news. Yep. It's a new show. Here. Yeah. Oh, I know. Oh, I know. And, and you can tell my intro. Actually, you can tell my in intro about this news. Why? You'll find out. Let's get started. According to the article I, I have right here from, well, Harry Reporter, and I quote, New Alien Movie in the world with Don't Break from the Freddy Alvarez. Yep. We will discover drugs the Freddy Alvarez in 1979 will produce. Yep. The screaming space will be heard if Freddy Alvarez had anything to say about it. The filmmaker behind Don't Breathe and 2013 Evil Dead have been tapped to write and direct a little standard alien feature for 2070 Studios. Yep. We will discover the drug with no cyber horror movies in 1979 and return to two 21st century installments will produce via a Scott Free banner. The project is intended to be made by Hulu as part of 2017 ambition to make more than 10 movies a year of a Disney owned streaming service. Oh yeah, I forgot, since 2075 got bought off by Disney, they had to get banned with the 20th century studios, which it's kind of a bad name to my thing about. I got this 20 box. Yeah, 20 box might be in the fuck a lot of it for any day, believe me. I don't like that coming at all. But I still count the name bad because that name actually made a lot more sense to me. Maybe that's me, but as a fan of movie guarantee, I'm more a fan of that with no studio name. But whatever. Um, and yeah, it may see you the prequel focusing on a horror figure with the way I'm being called when eggs are going by, yeah, we know it's right. Okay, if you don't know, know an idea what aliens are, you've been living under a rock for the past century. And at this point, you get a point. Two more movies we were born in and then the crossover with Fox Earth and Batman Predator. We were killed as anymore in this event. Scott returned to his co creating prequel, Prometheus, and then Aaron Covenant, which. Heck. Do I say about Covenant? Covenant was just garbage. Fuck that movie. Prometheus, I, I didn't underwear. I kind of like that movie. In fact, my brother has a cyber movie, I think that is pretty good. So, if you didn't have an alien for that, it actually is a good idea of sci-fi, big as a um, sci-fi video with a movie. Like, didn't have an alien for that, and pretend that it was own separate thing, you're good to go. Back for the school, I think for me, I mean, there's a lot more bad job in doing prequel for aliens than actual alien coding, which is garbage. Whatever, um, I would like to have been kept deep, deep inside to chat, but sort of describe it, unconnected to previous movies. Wait, what? So, wait, 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 stop. We're going straight. So, this movie is not connected to the Ridley Scott nonsense. It's not connected to Prometheus. Not connected to Aaron Covenant. So, it's its own separate thing. Okay, if that's the case, then I mean, I, you know, we're not to continue the Ridley Scott idea. Which, thank God! Maybe we can get the Xenomorph back on track and be the actual monster horror monster what it's supposed to be. Not be a created by an android. Take note with this guy, don't try and make your own career and making the different career order in my hand by Android. That makes no sense. Whatever, more. 
Going story, Avalon and Robert Van Fran and Kyrie picked it, it, it to take the Scott many years ago. The idea of man imprinted in Scott's brain until late ye- last year when he called Avalon out of the blue and asked him if the younger promo was, was still up for it. Avalon didn't have to be asked twice. Twins he picked up the project, purely off the strength of faded pitch, so the man imprinted in the Avalon, it was really just a good story with a bunch of characters you haven't seen before. Okay. Um, Abel, who usually spoke to THR, spoke about the future of 20th century, said by doing the project for who, there wouldn't be the pressure to whittle down the potential edginess that could, could, could come with the fiasco consideration. It's not a film that uh, had to be all things to all people with the gargantian gar- gar- budgets. They get to be authentically what they are, and they just call it to a genre roots. So we're going back to a low-key horror movie. Okay. I'm all for that. Maybe that can work. Maybe it would be good and I'd be stupid. Apple is saying he loved the genre work he had gained following in for unspawned horror projects. Couldn't write and direct in 20 minutes and he would make Evil Dead. And currently the next version of the remake took a change to Massacre. FUCK! God damn it, that never was horrible! Fuck that thing to change to Massacre movie, that was crap! Ugh, fuck it, I hate that movie, that was crap. Anymore. His back communicates with uh, the fellow John Bree, a story the co or directed Bree and, and, and Jerry Seagull in 2021. Where it sucked! I heard the sequel's garbage and I'm not gonna talk about it uh, ever, ever again. I don't want to talk John Bree too. It's an unnecessary sequel that's for stupid and we didn't need to follow the old man who turned back in, into a villain on the air hill. That doesn't work! But whatever. Yup, and at the end, I'll argue that show. But I'll never get a new alien movie, so this could be really good or really bad. I made 50 50 of it. At the end, because I've been burned so many times in the alien with bad alien movies. So I'm not gonna hold my breath until it's gonna be good. What's gonna be good when a bad movie bullshit? Yup, and at the end, I'll argue that show. I know. My father, though, and you want to argue in front of everyone, and favorite at the at the type of horror acting movie I've watched in the past decades. I love this movie. Every the only one, every two. I said, I love Alien, I love Alien. Those movies are my favorite movie I did that came in front of me. However, I did Alien the entire way went to hell. Gee, what happened? Alright, okay, Alien 3 was crap, and oh my god, I don't want to try Alien 3. Alien 3 is an awful, awful movie. Don't ask. If, if you want to know what that movie is, even Dave Finney directly hate that movie. Which I don't blame him because Fox fucker was vision over and the movie went to shit. And the was say about the movie back. Then we get Alien 4, which was also crap. I think I, I think I have in the movie too, because it's so garbage. It's such an awful, awful movie. Because, oh my god, look at this shit. Like, what the fuck is that? Ugh. Yeah, th- th- that, if I, that is the human alien new, newborn. Don't ask. You don't want to know what the that thing came out. It's garbage, it's an awful idea, and it's crap. Yeah, it, it was like, it was just garbage, and I said about the movie, but it was an awful movie, don't ask, and you're not making it. Then we got Prometheus, which was a interesting thing I had to pre go my being in fact, both the scores I think Prometheus was super new way I had to like that movie, and I think we got, it was a good out of the movie. It was a good out of the side of horror movie, now with a good prequel to Alien, Kind of. It made sense. It actually made sense with the story. But then we got Alien Covenant. Which, you know, okay, that movie was kind of a beyond movie. It was an awful, awful prequel. And it made no sense. And then the, the Alien was created by the Android called David. And again, it makes no sense. It's a thing about it. Don't ask. And the last thing about the bit. So yeah, the Alien been like going down and down and ever since Aliens have an anti shit went. Died and went to hell. So, yeah. Ellie's really been on the shit recently, so I don't know how to feel with this new movie. Now, is it part of this new movie can fit in? Can the um, director of Don't We bring back the friend that back from the dead? Um, it's part of he can do it, but since he was this guy producing it, that doesn't give me a lot more hope because no matter who this guy tried to find go to hell again, so since he's involved, I just don't know how I feel about how this can work. Don't know. Fred Albert is a good director. I just say he directed Don't Breathe, which is a good acting horror movie. And you got pretty good horror movies. What the first Don't Breathe? First Don't Breathe is a good movie, my man. Super New Way, I think it was really good. Do not want the seagull. The seagull can go to hell. Fuck the seagull. Like, what? The first movie is all good. 
also want to remain evil dead, remain evil dead all the good, but you my point. So, this guy knew that knew the stuff about horrors, but the guy the fan of the franchise. So, if anyone actually inherited the alien, it's him. Now, do I believe that this maneuver could work? Do I believe the alien factor could come out from the dead even after three out the failures? Um, it possibly, but then again, I don't know how to feel about this movie going to Hulu because since this movie is going to Hulu, the point, if the point of it that is going, does that mean that they're not going to have a big budget? If they have no big budget, fine. I'm a for it because remember, the first alien movie was, was made by, uh, by a side of horror movie, yeah, small budget. So if they're going with a small budget, maybe I can work in favor. Yeah, yeah because when you think about it, the first alien movie was made out actually with a small, small, small budget. So if they're going out with that logic, you know, they make the movie kind of a small budget, kind of the first alien movie, then you know what? Yeah, that can actually work in favor because when you think about it, the first alien movie was made with a small budget and would. But even though know, it had been side by, by big at the shift, uh, it was some uh, big uh, particle in CGI. So, if anything, I think this is where I think in, in, in favor to go back for the small, small budget. So, I think this is where I at the end in, in favor. Now, what I said, for the early movie concern, do I think this new early movie could work? Um, it's 50-50 shot because the Paramount Disney is going to go on a Hulu. I just don't know how to feel that I feel about that at all, but you know what? I've seen shit in that before. So maybe the movie actually does go down actually go a good horror movie route and don't fuck it up, then I think this could be the only glad shit to make a good alien movie. Because we have a good alien movies in alien aliens and that's just sad because I want aliens to survive and not die. But since alien man could be shit show, they did the last chance. They fucked us up! Then you can hit alien for that goodbye. Because we've been burned so many times to get a uh, good alien movie for years. And at this point, you should you, sure gonna do this. One, don't fuck it up. Two, please, please, oh my god, you're not, we're, we're just gonna tuck the story. Because it's bad enough we didn't do it any of the last time. I don't do it any David bullshit. But like I said, for real, in the channel. So I'm just more, more um, information about it and forget what's going on. Let's just hope for the best. Put on the worst and pray that this didn't turn good no hole. Now if it didn't go to shit, then yeah, you keep it pretty goodbye because I'm like Predator with big I think in a weird all the weird weird route right now. I think alien you know, is big unsoldable, but at this point, we just hope we can get alien move on it. We haven't get alien for years, so I'll take anything or nothing. Bunch of them we sent. But I ain't no more talk. Hmm. I think mean, I mean, that's all right. Oh, yeah, I'm interested. Oh, the only one the only movie in the world with Don't Free, I'm from Mega Freddy Alvarez. I'm free on comment number three. You can bring my engineers to work it to me today. I'm also working for you on Twitter. Please, I'm Scott McChown for two stars. Please get back on comment. Yeah, I'll tell my story. Please, as you can. So, one way, I'm hyped for any other movie coming out of Hulu. You may be really good or really yeah. bad. Please, I'm um, comment number one. I'll talk a little bit longer. Aaron, see ya. Bye, Aaron. Say bye, Aaron. Say bye, Aaron. Say bye for the hour. Get up, man. See ya. Bye. We just got to go fuck it up. See ya. Bye, Aaron. Say bye, Aaron. Say bye.